And if we had to brand the forecast court, I would say it's staying cool, looking good. It is, and it's kind of funny to say cool when we're really still talking about 90s, but Kelly, yeah. compared to what we've seen, this is gonna be extremely pleasant over the next couple of days. And I wanna turn your attention to this one hour time lapse from our Tuscan Butte camera. This is located to the east of Red Bluff in Tehama County, and it's looking east over Lassen Peak bright skies over Northern California this morning. Going to see that sun rising over the crest in the next half an hour. And boy, it's going to be a gorgeous start to your Thursday across our region. Now temperatures are trending down a bit across Northern California right now compared to yesterday. We're in the 60s across the board for the valley with the biggest cooling influence in our southern zone. 61 for Orville, 64 degrees for Chico, up to 69 in Redding and 66 in Red Bluff. 50s to 60s in the foothills. Mostly still low to mid 50s in our mountain zone, so pretty comfortable start to the day. Winds out of the east up to around 5 to 6 miles an hour right now, but it's going to be southeast winds heading into your afternoon. And this is going to be the trend over the next few days. So southeast gusts up to around 15 miles an hour later today. Not seeing a big uptick this evening. And then it's another day of 15 to 20 mile an hour gusts out of the southeast in the afternoon Friday. And we'll see more of the same heading into your weekend. We do see gusts getting a little stronger closer to the Nevada border. That's where fire danger will be a little bit more of a concern but we're not seeing wind that's in the right home about over the weekend forecast either. Satellite and radar, clear conditions overhead as we start off your Thursday morning. A little change of pace. Now, yesterday we had some thunderstorm activity popping up in our higher elevations of the northern mountains, close to the Nevada and Oregon borders as well, from low pressure that's tracking inland right now that's driving the Delta breeze. So that cooler air mass riding north into our region, and that is going to leave us with temperatures kept in check today. High pressure off the coast, however, keeping our skies mostly sunny, that low pressure moving in, also providing just enough moisture to our region to spark off the potential for some instability and thunderstorms this afternoon and evening. Clear skies overhead at 8 a.m. across the valley. You're going to need those sunglasses. Start to see a chance for some pop-up showers in the late afternoon hours. For the valley, however, we're still seeing dry weather and sunshine for today, as are the foothills. That chance for some activity popping up a little bit better late afternoon into this evening in the northern mountains, southern Cascades, and northern Sierra. Dry and sunny for the start of your Friday. The chance for some active weather popping up Friday afternoon. It looks a little bit more likely tomorrow than what we're even seeing today, but we still have that delta breeze cooling us off a bit. Heading into your weekend, it's more sunshine and temperatures below average Saturday and Sunday. Great weather for getting outside. High pressure building back in early to midweek next week, driving sunshine and temperatures on the rise in your extended forecast. So take advantage of the below average highs while they last. Today, it's going to be pretty comfortable. Low to mid 90s still in the northern mountains, though, with that threat of thunderstorms in the afternoon. 80s for the most part in the Sierra and Southern Cascades. Foothill areas in the upper 70s to upper 80s. If you're in the valley today, mid to upper 90s for the northern zones. 97 degrees for Redding, 95 for Red Bluff. Down to the south, low to mid 90s. 93 in Chico and 94 for Orville. If you're heading out to the Thursday night market this evening, looks like a pretty great one for you. Lower 90s for the start at 6 p.m., mid 80s for the time it wraps up at 9 p.m. And ahead in your Storm Tracker 7 day forecast where your weekend's always in view. Lower 90s for Chico Friday through Sunday with lows in the low 60s, low to mid 90s Monday, and then back into those mid to upper 90s Tuesday with triple digit heat for the middle of next week. So we are heating back up in your extended forecast. Reading it's mid to upper 90s through the weekend, mid to upper 90s again on Monday, triple digit heat returning Tuesday and lasting through the middle of next week. So Kelly, fantastic news if you're trying to get outside through this weekend. Temperatures staying below average.